stop, 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 stop. There's been so much talk about immigration that I think it's good to go see an event that shows real people grappling with the changed circumstances of the Trump administration. This is a Milwaukee school board meeting where they're going to vote on a resolution to make Milwaukee schools a sanctuary system. We must love each other and support each other. We must love each other and support each other. This would basically make the schools a shield against federal immigration officers and would help students when they're on school property not be subject to deportation and try to keep families safe as well. First and foremost, I'd like to address Trump. One does not make a country great by treating people like garbage. No. I hope you all have this clear. We're here to stay and we're ready to take on everything and anything you throw at us. What do you think drives people to be attracted towards Donald Trump's point of view on immigration? I don't know. <laughs> um, there's a lot of hatred still in the United States. I feel like Trump opened that door a lot more. Um, like simply I'm in school and there's a kid, like he knows I'm an immigrant. He knows I come from Mexico. Now he like blurts things out like, oh, immigrants are like rats. If you had rats in your house, you wouldn't want them there. I don't know, I just feel like Trump was the gateway to all of that. First of all, um, I want to thank everybody for coming out tonight. Tell me what's at stake tonight in this meeting. Uh, this is a very significant vote. The school represents the most diverse uh, student body in the state of Wisconsin. We will now uh, take public testimony. Hi, everyone. My name is Faru Grashid. It sends a very important message because we're working on similar resolutions um, in other uh, school districts across Wisconsin. Why did those young people come out here today? They came out here because they've been working really, really hard. They've been organizing really hard. They met, lobbied with all of the school board members. Trump is the biggest bully, um, and we have to stand up to him. They're setting an example, and this is a critical place to set that example. I had one of the toughest second graders, and he just cried in my arms and said, I'm so scared that someone's going to take my daddy away. Um, you can't teach like that, and you can't learn like that. I want to leave MPS and say I'm proud knowing that they were the, there to protect us when we mostly needed them. I know my parents have big expectations of me. I know. I know, I know. <laughs> There are many families like mine who are terrified of what can happen to us. We deserve peace. I urge you to support this resolution. Thank you. Uh, to approve the resolution that was submitted, Director Harris. Aye. Director Joseph. Aye. Vice President Miller. Aye. Director Voss. Aye. Director Woodward. Aye. Director Zaki. Aye. And President Sane. Aye. That's eight ayes. The motion passes. <laughs> Washington, getting out of New York and seeing how real people are grappling with the Trump administration is so valuable. These are young kids. Some of these kids are elementary school, junior high school, high school. This is their lives. This is their parents' lives. This is 
what they worry about and think about every day, and it's, it is not an abstraction. It's real life for them.